Hey guys, and a big welcome to Tom's Films. Today I am back, and I am back with another video. I'm uh, well and truly spoiling you guys. Um, I appreciate I've uh, I've just gone a couple of months without a video, so I thought I need to make up for lost time. Obviously, I have um, I have uh, recently done my uh, my batch donut review with uh, with my mate. Um, I wish I was clever enough to say I'm going to pop a description somewhere, but that's what professional YouTubers do, and I'm just literally a, a 26 year old man with an iPhone, so I, I don't have the know how for that. Anyway, I've been shopping today, and I managed to find this Prime Globery. Now, this one is apparently ultra rare, although to be fair, they were saying that about all the other ones when they first come out. Wakey Wines, um, we're selling this for probably about £100 a bottle, but um, no, joking aside, I know that kind of like corner shops prior to it becoming kind of available, we're selling it for kind of 20, 30 quid a bottle. I'd never spend, you know, spend anything like that on a bottle of Prime, but there we are. So they came into stock in Aldi's. Uh, obviously, as you can probably tell by the accent, I'm based in the UK. If you're watching this from far and wide, if I if I reach that far, uh, I'm based in the UK, um, and we have a supermarket called Aldi, and that's why they were selling these. And they were selling these for one ninety nine a bottle. So I thought, you know what? Why not? Um, it's quite a rare flavour, apparently. I, I say rare. I mean, obviously, they are kind of widely available, but I don't think it's like a permanent flavour. You know, with the other primes, you know, like your orange and your lemon and lime, etc. They're kind of more staple features. Um, however, this Globry one, a bit like the K the the KSI Mango Limited Edition one they did, um, I think kind of when they're out of stock, they're out of stock, and, and it's not going to be kind of like a, a regular routine flavour. So, without further ado, obviously, because I'm not gonna I'm not gonna waffle. Just a side note as well. Apparently, it's a glow in the dark bottle. Um, unfortunately, I've been travelling around in the boot of my car all day, so I you know I can't really test it. If I turn the lights out now, it'll just go pitch black. But um, but yeah, so obviously I'll. Uh, be interested to see if it actually is a glow in the dark bottle. I have no idea what flavour it's supposed to be. It is quite a cool bottle design. It is kind of quite like Halloween-y themed, I think, so it's quite appropriate uh, given the fact that I'm filming this video in October. Um, yeah, I don't actually know what flavour it's meant to be. So, like I say, without um, without waffling, I'll, uh, I'll give it a go. So I'm just going to open it up and take a sip. That lovely click. Give it a smell first. With a nose like mine, I can uh, smell things that maybe others can't. It smells like sour apple. Let's have a look. Yeah, that's quite nice. It's definitely um, got some apple in it. Almost like a, you know, like when you were a kid and you had like sour apple sweets or something. It's uh, it's like a sour apple -y flavour um, that kind of hits you straight away. That kind of like sour apple -y kind of yeah flavour, and then after that, it's kind of slightly more subtle. And there's a, there's like another fruit in there, but I can't quite work out what it is. I don't know if my friends love it when I do that noise, but um, but yeah, no, I, I I can't work out what it is. I'm I'm just gonna go with the fact that I think it's like apple -y flavoured. Um, yeah, it's nice. It's not my favourite flavour prime, um, to be honest. I, I don't think you can go far wrong with the, from the lemon and lime or the blue raspberry, the uh, the OGs. But um, yeah, it's nice. I'd rate it about a 6 out of 10. I think the main appeal for this one was the fact that it's apparently super rare limited edition. Um, yeah, no, it's nice. With that then, I'll, uh, I'll bring this video to a close. Stay tuned, because like I say, I'm making up for lost time now. So there will be uh, there will be more videos coming up. But until next time, see you later.